Vey Victus. One of, if not the most highly anticipated custom zombies map to ever come out, and I'm excited to give it a try today. Okay, here we go. I am so hyped for this. This looks crazy. So from my understanding of this, is this is supposed to be like BO3's take on Outbreak, but we're following the Victus crew all the way through the Dark Aether, which is sick. Looks like we can't break these uh, little crystals though. A little disappointing, but I'm sure there's a lot more to find here. And from my understanding, this started out as a way to like kind of remake Transit and turn it into what they thought the creators of the map wanted it to be, which is like some big open world map that we can actually get a lot of stuff done on without having to, you know, run through the fog and knife denizens the whole time. But so far, this looks great. This looks beautiful. And I wonder if the bus is actually here. Wait, what is this? Oh, I got a Gersh. That's insane. That's a crazy drop. But I don't know how Outbreak's gonna really work in BO3. There's a lot more zombies spawning in than there would in like Cold War Outbreak, which is already cool. What is a fling grenade? Oh, wait, we, we switched it out for the Gersh. Okay, let me try the fling grenade first. Okay, I don't know what that did, but there was a lot of love put into this. There's supposed to be like a main Easter egg. There's a bunch of side Easter eggs in here. It's got like a bunch of other bosses. Hold on. Let me read straight from the Steam page real quick. There's three returning wonder weapons, one new wonder weapon, five objectives like Outbreak. There's world events. There's a parachute system. There's returning and remastered classic Aether locations. And it's got zombies, keepers, furies, furries, custom crazy sold that, which is like the Panzer, manglers, Tempest and a custom warden. All that sounds pretty good to me. But since we got the box right here, we might as well use it and uh, see what our first weapon is. Maybe we get a wonder weapon right off the bat here. And let me throw a Gersh just to make sure these zombies stay the hell away from me. Might be a waste of a Gersh, but it's whatever. Oh, we get the PDW, whatever. Maybe one more pull. Grenade launcher, not bad. I'll take it. What is this? Monkey bomb? I'll take it. A lot of I'll take it's right now. But it's cool that weapons actually drop on the ground like that. Like I traded in my 1911 and it's sitting there on the ground. A huge feature of Cold War that I like to see. And what is this? I need the key to get in that area. That's like Mob of the Dead little lock right there. What we got in the bus station here? Is it still like the same thing? Pretty much. Oh, we got Quick Revive in here. I should probably pick that up. But I'll be taking Quick Revive. Maybe I won't be. Oh, wait, it gave it to me. I just didn't see the animation. What is this? Legendary LMG for one key. Bars. But I don't have a key, so we'll have to leave it there. And what is this? Is this Ted? Ted, what are you doing here, buddy? We gotta repair you? Okay, well, we'll come back to that. All right, now let's explore outside the bus depot. What they got out here. Is that called the dead up there? Is that the church from Buried? Oh, there's too much stuff to look at. We'll make our way over here towards this green. Whatever this green glow is. I don't know if this does anything. It's just, just floating around. It just might be how the Aether is. Okay, on to the next. Oh, is this the farm from uh, Transit? The little farm stop? Pretty sick. And it looks like there's box locations everywhere. Like, it, the box doesn't move. It just has different locations at each spot. That's also a cool way to mark each POI, especially since we don't really have a map here. Or at least I don't know how to access it. And there's ammo drops on the ground. So they're adding in some elements from Cold War. Ooh, a box. Speaking of Cold War elements, not a whole lot in that box, though. Now, what's this place, though? Bunch of bunkers. Maybe some sort of, like, military base? I'm gonna freak out if we, like, get to the center of this, and it turns out that it's, like, moon starting area. Well, let's hop in and see. What's this? Ooh, what? Okay, so instead of a death machine, I just get the Wonder Waff for a minute? That's an insane power-up. That's nasty. It looks like Gersh's are not even, like, that rare of a drop. I keep getting them. Oh my god, I was right. This is sweet. Look at this. I almost wish I wouldn't have guessed it because this is fucking awesome. Honestly, it's a little calm over here now compared to what it'd be like if we actually played the map. Can you use the pack-a-punch here? Will it work? Oh my god, it will. All right, well, hold on. Let me get some money to pack a punch while we're here. This is so sweet, dude. This is what Outbreak should have been. Just a giant map full of like all the other zombies maps. This is so sweet. Wait, does this ammo give me more ammo for my grenade launcher? Let me reload it real quick. It does. Okay, I gotta pack a punch this thing. We also gotta find PhD so I don't uh, take myself out with it. I'm not even like anywhere near far into this map yet, but I just want to shout out all the people that made it. This is such a fucking cool idea and it's already looking beautiful. All right, let's see if this is pack a punchable. It is. Ooh, Chunky's pineapple launcher. Kind of insane. Oh, and it's pack a punch one. I wonder if this is like Cold War's pack a punch system where I can pack a punch it like all the way up to three. Let's see. Oh yeah, 1500 for the next one. Or is that 150,000? No, that's 1500. I can't read. Okay, we know where pack a punch is now. Let's uh maybe do this main task and explore the map a little bit. Hold on, wait a second. What does this sign say? Welcome to Camp Edward. No way. Me acting like I know what that means. Is that Nuketown? I think it's Nuketown. Now is this gonna be like Alpha Omega Nuketown or is this gonna be like 
the OG Nuketown map. Oh, look at the little jellyfish. The tiny aether jellyfish. That's beautiful. And these textures look crazy too. Oh, look at this. Nuketown. Hold on, there's a bunker. Can we go in it? The bunker is locked by the warden's key. Or just a pathway key, whatever. We need to find some of these keys. I see a very familiar sign. We got die rise too. How is that here? That looks pretty uh, short, unless there's like a canyon. Oh, did the building fall apart? That's actually kind of cool. Poop of the dead reference. I'm getting so distracted by the, the whole world here that I haven't gone to the event yet. So let's keep on pushing forward. What the fuck is this? Healing aura? Did I really just pick up a field upgrade? What happens if I uh, do this? No way. Okay. Might have been a little bit of a waste, but that's sweet that they got like Cold War field upgrades as just drops in game. Can I shoot that? There's just Nova 6 in the bathroom. That's what I'd be dropping when I shit. There's a bunch of like writing on the wall. Kind of like uh, a little left for dead. And what is this? Is this going into the town? I wonder if town has pack a punch too. Well, uh, maybe I use the zip line. Let's see what's over here. Oh, there's jug. I need that. Gimme. And we're at our main event. Is there anything else around here that I should check out first? A little box spawn. And what's in here? A bowling alley. That's kind of cool. What's our mission? What we got to do? Break the chains. Got it. Oh, we just have to survive in here. Is this a holdout round? Oh, this is like outbreak containment. Or not containment. Onslaught. Onslaught something. We got to escort this little ball. Where are you leading us, orb? Are we going to the diner? Ooh, what's going on, diner? This looks beautiful in the dark aether. Them adding in the little dark aether pubes to it. Just a little cherry on top. Oh, they got speed cola in here. I wonder if there's a perk limit. Or if they got rid of that for this. Aether Shroud, give me that. That's way more helpful solo than what Healing Aura would be. Oh, well, we completed the objective. Let's go. Who's the prophet? Destiny ass looking character. Find the beacon and keep fighting. Find the beacon, keep fighting. Bus beacon located. I need to get on that bus now. Maybe I should grab speed cola though while we're here. Give me that. Okay, I did say that I need to get to the bus immediately, but there's a big robot head right here. I had to go take a peek. And this is called the dead. Basically the same layout as the map too. Just uh, with a little less ice and a little less uh, Romero as well. Are the boys still trapped down here? No, this is open. Sort of. Need a key to get in there. How do I get these keys? How do I reach these keys? Maybe I'll just climb to the top here. Loot some boxes on the way. Oh, it's a big loot chest, too. Give me another Gersh. Nothing else too crazy. Oh, and a Wonder Fizz? Shit. Well, give me stamina up for here. And then I'm broke, so I can get anything else. Well, that's sweet. Oh, well, maybe uh, while we're here, I should rack up some money so I can see if there's actual perk limit. Okay, let me see if we can get PhD. We can. Sweet. All right, cool. No perk limit here. And now we just made this gun kind of busted. All right, well, I guess that's all we need. We know where the Wonder Fizz is now if we need more perks. Let's uh, start heading towards our main objective. Which way is faster? I guess I'll take this zip line. Or maybe I'll just jump off and parachute. The parachute's kind of sick. Like, it just gives you a little, like, aether thing surrounding you. Oh, ring of fire. Okay, hold on. Let me try out aether shroud real quick. All the zombies just stop moving. Now, give me my baby. Now, what happens if I do this? Quick ring of fire on him. Yep, this is all they needed to add it. I'm sold. This is the best map ever made. This is beautiful. Oh, Mr. Bus. Oh, what? There was a pack a punch and a wonder fist here the whole time. Oh, so this works like the beacon. Is this a shield? Are we taking that? What's going on, Ted? Good to see you again. Anything else I should get from this? Let me grab double tap. Oh, wait, look at this is PhD slider, not flopper. I get that long slide. On top of just having BO3 slide, this is crazy. I can just slide constantly. That's sick. All right, let's move on. Let's hit the beacon. Changing rounds. This is a sweet animation for it too. That's so sick. Now I'm assuming the map don't change at all. Yeah, we just go back to the OG spot, but now it's a little more difficult, I guess. Oh, what the fuck are you? Damn. Oh yeah, immediately we're getting other kinds of zombie types. That's fucking crazy. Oh, did I just pick up a key? Is that what that was? Okay, where should I use this key at? There's a few locations. What was the, the coolest? Or maybe there's a new location we haven't been to yet. That might be better. All right, what is this main event? We begin the retrieval. And we have two minutes and 30 seconds to go. And holy shit, those are far away. Okay, so we should probably get the farthest one first. Retrieve the skulls. I'll be taking that skull. Oh, you can throw it? Shit. Where's the area? Oh, it's right over here. I'm gonna toss that bitch. Now we're going for the next area. Oh, is that a mangler? Fuck off, mangler. Eat that. And a tempest. Okay, well, let me grab the skull. Let me throw that boy. And let me get right on these guys. Easy max ammo. Means easy kills. 
Maybe not. These manglers are tanking shots. Holy shit. And we only got a minute left to finish this. Pick up the skull, please. Let's go over here. Toss it in, right? No. Oh, you actually I just have to throw it in. Actually toss it in. Oh, did I throw this in the wrong spot? I'm gonna be pissed if I can't get back up there. Oh, that's not good. I need to find a way on this rock. Oh, shit. Did I throw? Actually, I think the only way we can get it is if we jump off of the lighthouse and fly to it. And we don't got a whole lot of time to do it. Holy shit. Oh, fuck. I think I threw the game. I just need to get up high enough to where I can jump there. This is probably good, right? We, we don't got a whole lot of chances at this, so. Gotta do it now. And I fucked it. Got a lot of PhD kills, though. But we failed our objective. Objective complete, actually. You know what? We're failing upwards. That went about as good as it could have gone right there. I'm glad there's a little bit of leeway. Oh, what? Let me use this key. What does this do? Nothing. Did I just waste a key? Hopefully those keys aren't super rare. Maybe we can activate this teleporter at another time. I'm actually disappointed by that key use. Fuck it, though. Let's just keep going. Let's get the hell out of here, Ted. Okay. New objective found. Eliminate. I'm a little scared for this. Oh, these zombies are tanking these shots now? Yeah, we need pack two. Before we even go to this eliminate event, I need to get this pack a punched again. Oh, we're right next to the eliminate event, though. Should we just do it? Fuck it. Let's do it. We can survive it. We got a ring of fire. What am I worried about? Oh, we're getting sucked in the air. What happened? Is this supposed to be happening? Yep. I'm the one getting launched now. What the fuck is this? Oh, is it coming out of this portal? Hell nah. They just tossed us into an arena. And it's a mangler. You know what? Just ring a fire on him. Hit him with this. Easy. That was way easier than I thought it was going to be. But I'm getting launched away. Are we heading back? I just might be too good for this. Oh no, we're getting another one. Might have pre-jacked that ring of fire then. Oh, and it's a panzer too. Fuck off, buddy. This thing's tanking damage. Give me a ring of fire now. Oh, there it is. We got it. Let's use it. Let's be enough. Oh, we got the Wonder Wolf. Does that do anything to him? Doesn't look like it. What a bad power up to get during a ring of fire. Really sick power up though. I'm not going to lie to you. Die, motherfucker. Oh, out of ammo for our, our little boop de dee bop. We got to throw a Gersh. Drop ammo for me. There we go. I'll be taking that. How many grenades does it take to kill a panzer? Might be too many. Let's use another ring of fire on him. That's two ring of fires. Does ring of fire do extra damage in this? Or is it just here to, so I can shoot infinitely? This has got to have like infinite health. There's no way it's not dead yet. Okay. Out of ammo again for our launcher. I'm starting to think maybe I just have to use a gun against them. Even though this thing is not pack-a-punched at all. It's probably doing even less damage. Like it's not even killing these zombies really. But if we ring a fire... I don't think it's doing a whole lot more. Oh, no, we did kill it. Let's go. Would have liked to get some of the rewards on the ground there, though. Could use some of that ammo. Do we have another one to fight? This event is insane. Don't be another panzer, please. Oh, we got a tempest, huh? Hold on, let me throw a Gersh to get rid of all these zombies here. Now let's lay into them. Easy. So everything else just has no health besides those panzers. Those panzers are ridiculous. Those things are strong as shit. And now we got some shmoney to work with. Ah, yes. Of course you would be unfamiliar with our world's creation. Who's the goddess? Besides myself, obviously. All right, let's get back to the bus. I'm coming, Ted. All right, let's see if there's a second pack-a-punch camo. Nope, same one, but pack two now. But they are talking about a beacon of light earlier, and now the lighthouse is pointing in this direction. I'm gonna go see why. Something's going on over here. Oh, the artifact. Give me that. Is this the start of the main quest? Now it's pointing in another direction. Let's go there. We might be onto something. It looks like it's going in this direction. Let's fly a little bit. Oh, I should have used my key over here. It would have been much cooler going into the bunker. Do I still have a key or did I use it? Oh, I still have a key. Let's go. And a mangler spawn down here? Hell no. Bring a fire, your bitch ass. Sit down. Did I get anything out of that? No. Weird. What are these areas for? The artifact in here? I hear a noise. Oh, it's right here. Give me that. I think the lighthouse is back to just spinning around, right? Or is it pointing in just one direction over there? Let's go see. Who's the preservationist? All these destiny-ass characters talking to me. For now, children, find the beacon and move on. Oh, now they're telling me just go to the beacon and move on. Honestly, I'm kind of hoping this Easter egg's easy because my dumbass can barely figure out how to spell my name, let alone solve a complex Easter egg on my own. You know that? Or maybe this is just for uh, the map's wonder weapon. As I said, there is a new wonder weapon in this. We'll go find out if uh, this is it. Let's go ahead and move on to the next area. Actually, let me pack a punch my, my other gun real quick. Changing the rounds. See you later. Goodbye. On to the next. Anything crazy now? Besides my ammo slowly counting up one by one. Oh, there's an artifact. It sits on a meteorite. 
high above us. Sits on a meteorite high above us. This one? I just fucking disappeared. Okay, so our only objective here is to bring down the artifact, and I don't know necessarily where it is. I see meteors falling. I don't know where they're falling to, but it telling us to bring it down probably means it's going to be something way in the air. Uh, the highest point is up on this lighthouse, so I'm going to go check that out and see if I can see it from up there. So let's see. Um, is that the artifact? The sun? Nope. I have no idea what they're talking about with this artifact. Not gonna lie to you. This is the point where I start looking stuff up. I think I got it figured out. It looks like if we go back to Groom Lake, back at Area 51, there's a big gun to shoot it down. So I'm gonna go find that. Oh, you know what? I think I've been using these fling grenades all wrong this whole time. So if I pick these things up and I throw it this way, I get thrown with it. No wonder. That can probably lead us to some pretty broken spots. But for right now, let's find where this gun is. Okay, so we're back at just normal Groom Lake. A place where Minecraft YouTubers go to, you know, vacation. It's like our summer camp. The teleport looks like it's on. We can't use it. Oh, here's the gun, though. I should probably get some ammo before I start this up. I don't know how this is going to go. All right, we're almost good on ammo. That should be enough right there. Let's see if we can start this. Hold the fire. Where's the shooting at, though? Oh, I just took it down. Where's it landing at? Oh shit, is it coming towards me? No, it's in the gas station. Oh, holy shit. This is sweet. Oh wait, we have our bus here, but it's not saying we can leave. What's up, Ted? Oh wait, I can remove you. Okay. That did something. What am I transferring? What the fuck is this? Requires Artemis interface. Artemis from It's Always Sunny? Oh wait, I can do it. Begin scanning. <gasps> There's his head. Oh, we need to survive here for two minutes. This looks insane, though. This is sweet. This map is fucking legendary. This is the coolest custom map I've ever played in my life. What is that sound? I don't like that. Gersh, go. This is fucking ridiculous. There's so much shit going on. Out of ammo again? Damn, dude. And I'm out of Gersh's, so that's not good. And nades. Uh, we got a monkey bomb, though. I'll use this. Go ahead and get to it. Oh, and that's it. Monkey bomb's still here, though. Unbelievable. Quick summaries of scans show the amount of data contained here is colossal. Transfer colossal to amount of data. Scans. Transfer failed. Wait, why are we still in the human's automaton? It seems in the absorption of this artifact's power, we have crashed our network systems. We are unable to return to our physical forms. Damn, these guys got DDoSed right out of their own bodies. So we need to place yes, the head course. in the automaton, Children, whatever, at Olympus. Beacon. Base. So we need to go back to the bus now. Should probably get some ammo before we leave, though. And we're only 5,000 away from getting pack three, so I'm gonna save up and get that, too. What is this? An aether tool? What? Oh, damn it, I should have used that on my launcher. I didn't know there was a thing to upgrade. Oh, there's an aether tool. Give me that. All of a sudden, they're dropping, so I'll take them. All right, we got enough money now. Let's get this pack-a-punch three and move on. There we go. And you can repack it for 45,000. Ridiculous number, by the way, but probably makes it insane. I wonder if it gives it an ammo mod, but uh, let's go ahead and move on. We'll go with the headless Ted. I hope I didn't have to pick his head up or anything, because it's already too late for that. Okay, what's our objective now? Ascend. That's sweet. They even made their own little icon for the lighthouse. The corruption engine will require a large singular charge of ethereal energy into the heart to trigger a manual reboot. You know, large a large singular charge of ethereal energy. However, we're supposed to get that. I have no idea. I have not gotten any of the wonder weapons yet in this. This has kind of been its own wonder weapon, but maybe I'll spin the box one or two times to see if we can get something new. Let's see. Oh! Jet gun immediately. Okay, just got to talk about it and you get it. I'm pretty sure they, they fixed the jet gun so don't overheat as much or don't overheat at all. But I'll take it. We needed a third weapon anyways. Okay, I'm just over here fighting zombies. Let's uh, start making our way to the lighthouse. You do not have the Ethereum power necessary to jumpstart our corruption engine. Perhaps since it does not come naturally to you, you would be able to craft a weapon capable of manipulating Ethereal energy. We need to craft a weapon. So I'm thinking we need the map's wonder weapon. I'm glad it's telling us that before we actually get up here. But how? How do I craft it? We, we picked up two parts, but I'm assuming it's going to need three, right? Everything needs three parts. That's just like the, the golden rule of zombies. I got to figure out how to make this wonder weapon. These trees. I believe I know what they are. Oh, this dude's talking about the trees? We got a stoner robot over here. He's actually talking about something. So I'm assuming we're close to whatever wonder weapon part we need. It appears these Jaboko. What the fuck? 
Maybe yet more they can show us. What the fuck are you talking about? Speak English. We're just talking like an encyclopedia. But something's going on over in this area, and I don't know what. Oh, okay. I just had to fucking just sit there and bitch about it, and I got it. Every time I complain about something, something happens, so... I'm doing something right. The trees have thanked us for putting them to rest. Now the trees have thanked us, like the Lorax. That is no mere branch, Prophet. That is a direct link to their web of life. That is no mere branch, Prophet. Serve well in construction of a godly weapon. It would serve well in construction of a godly weapon. So I think we do have all of our parts for our wonder weapon now. We just need to find where to build it. And I'm assuming it's going to be back at like the original bus station, right? Let's see if we can find our way back there. Okay, here's the bus depot. Let's see if uh, we can build it here. Oh, here's here's a workbench, actually. I throw on a Gersh so I don't die. Can I build it? No. I don't know how to. Right, I'm not gonna lie, I looked up where to make the Wonder Weapon. There's not a whole lot of, like, videos out right now because this map's only been out one day, so I was watching somebody's stream of it. And it looks like if I just go over here, I should be able to get it. In this big green area, perhaps. So I guess we'll see. Or maybe not. Maybe I'm just fighting zombies for nothing. I must be still missing, like, a part to the Wonder Weapon or something. Because I am just so lost on how to make this. Oh, I never did that the whole time. I never grabbed the tip of the spear. This whole time, I needed the tip of this. I need to catch it. I think I got it. Maybe it didn't respawn. Nope, it did. Then we... Shoot this, hold X. Didn't get it again. Oh no, I accidentally picked up energy mine. Are you kidding me? Fuck. There goes Ring of Fire. This might take a bit. I don't know why it's not letting me catch this. I switched the keyboard and mouse midway through the game. I can. Let me try this. Got it. First try. So my only problem was I'm ass on controller. There we go. Assemble spear. And I need to get some souls to get it though. Let's go. We got it. It's been awoken. Sorry, jet gun. You fucking suck. So I'm switching you out. It's actually probably really good now that it's uh, in a custom map. But look at the spear. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, wait. Everywhere I throw it, it kind of puts down an effect. And it slows all these zombies down. That's kind of crazy. It makes all these zombies basically like one shot. Now let's see that if that's what we needed to go up to the lighthouse. All right, I'm not going to lie. There actually was one guide out there. Let me find who made it just so I can shout them out. It's from the No Thumbs crew. They have a whole Victus Easter egg guide. So shout out to them. Uh, let's throw this into the sphincter. Is that enough to power it? Did I do that right? Oh, let's go. Something's happening. Oh, a hold X to ascend. Let's do it. Well, my game's lagging dick. Let's hope this doesn't fuck my game up. Oh, we are ascending. This gotta be like the end of the Easter egg. Oh yeah, we're in a whole new area. This is creepy in here. Olympus base. Let's place it onto the Artemis. What's going on, Ted? And maybe that's not what we're supposed to do. Maybe we're supposed to put it on the other one. Or put it on both. Is that it? What the fuck? I'm supposed to have two? Two Teds? Or, okay, now I just need to place them on both. Cool. There's a whole cutscene. This is fucking crazy. I've never seen a custom map do anything this wild. Is that the goddess too? What's up, fucker? Looks like some trial machines, perhaps. One machine for each player. This looks sick. All right, let's place our Artemis. This is insane. What do I got to do here? Manually reboot. Reboot. Damn, I'm already having a stroke. Manually reboot the three data banks. And there's also no zombies out right now. Oh, is this Simon? Eh, I'm lost. If there wasn't guides to Easter egg, I'd never get them done. Red, green. Which one's red and which one's green? They're all the same color. Okay, so that's red, blue. Is this one green? That's yellow. Red, green. Red, green, yellow. Okay, red, green, yellow, red. Red, green, yellow, red, green, red, green, yellow, red, green, green, yellow, red, green, blue, red, green, yellow, red, green, blue. We did it. Let's fucking go. I'm a genius. Now we interact with little Ted. Merge that data on over. And some zombies are spawning. Okay, cool. Let's see how our spear does against some elites. Okay, it almost crashed the game. I saw it freeze for a second. Let's see if one of these zombies want to drop me Ring of Fire. So I'm disappointed in myself for losing that before we even got to the boss fight. Okay, so apparently, according to this guide, there's some valves I need to turn. These ones. There we go. And there's a timer. I don't know where they all are, though. There's two. Oh, here's one. There's another one. There's one on the wall. Come on. 
Oh, I did it too much. There's a lot of these bad boys. And I did it too much. Did it too much again. Classic. Is that all of them? Oh, I missed one. We got to redo them all. Okay, at least we kind of know where they're at. And we can't overdo them either. There's a lot more time than we think. We don't got to rush. That's one. That's two. That's three. That's four. There's five, six, seven. And I think there's the last one. Eight. We got it. Now what happens? Okay, there's just one Tempest now. Two Tempests. Do I have to get these Tempests to shock something? Back to the guide, because I got no idea. Okay, I, I was partially on there. We need the Tempest to come over here and shoot this. We need to turn these dials. Okay, we got it through. There we go. It's going through. Okay, we got that one to shoot. I just got to make sure this Tempest doesn't kill me. There we go. Now shoot this one. This one right here. Almost. Come on. There we go. Okay, last one. Shoot it. Beautiful. Now you can die. Let's interact with it again. Data's being merged. It's all restored. Advise. Slow data meld process recommend. Your memory expansions are aging and delicate. Damn, they call them old. Beginning of the data merge. Oh, shit. Wait, I think something's wrong. I, I, something's wrong? Who could have predicted? What the fuck? We claim pathetic piece No of way. Filth. Have we just made things worse? Damn right we did, Misty. The librarian's gone. You must bow to me or die. Minions, destroy them. Bring it. Engaging emergency ejection. They're sending another wave of zombies at me. This ain't gonna do nothing. Oh wait, it's telling us to get out of here? Emergency ejection? Fuck it, dude. We ball. We're back through the portal. Oh, let's go. We're at Groom Lake. Okay, then what do I do now? Oh, it's telling me the boss fight's coming up. I Prepare yourself. I into a nearby lockdown facility in order to construct something foul using our stolen bodies. Once you are prepared, find that place and we will continue. Okay, I need to find where the boss is at. Oh, it says board the bus. Wait, but there's two things. It's either board the, board the bus or find something else. Oh no, they're both on the bus. Oh, there's Ring of Fire. We got it back. Give me that. And now we have 45,000. So I want to see what happens if we pack a punch this again. Because if we get an ammo mod on this, it'll be insane. Let's find out. Um, I think we're just pack a punch four now. This thing just might just do a lot of damage. You know what? I'll take it. Get our insane weapon even more insane. All right, so this is... Continue objectives. Continue quest. I'm going to go ahead and uh, continue quest. Find a piece of technology can give you the power you need. And you can take automation head and reside into it. Oh, so it's going to tell us where to go. Cool. It tells us to come over here. That's just where we craft it. We need to place the Artemis. Just so happened to be Ted's head. Oh, shit. What's happening now? Oh, we just made the Artemis easy. This is sweet. So it's just Ted with a gun. This is like um uh, the Peacekeeper. Or whatever it's called from... Shadows. That's sick. There's three nav cards hidden somewhere. Find the navigational cards and bring them to us. And to find where those nav cards are, we're looking at the guide. Bus depot, buried cemetery, and Darice sign, or Dairi sign. I think we're already next to buried, so let's check this out. Oh, there's a nav card. Easy. I'll take that. Oh, and one said bus depot, and we just left there. Let's go back. Oh, it's right here. Give me that. Now, where's the Dairi sign? I don't remember where I saw it at earlier. Probably this way. Oh, it's right there in the mouth. Give me that. I think that's all three. Before we charge into battle, however, I must tell you something. What's up, goddess? The scribes the librarian left us indicate this thing is also from your world. From or my rather, world? Was banished there long ago. Oh? We call him Agamemnon. The Agamemnon. He's the that's amalgamation of the name. beings known to you as the Shadow Man and Dr. Monty. The king in purple. I recognize that name. Rick Toffin's boss? Oh. All right. Let's go beat his ass. I don't care whose boss he is. About to be the boss of these nuts. No, not connection interrupted. Are you fucking kidding me right here at the end? How is it interrupted? I'm just playing by myself. Don't do this to me. Let this be part of uh, the Easter egg, all right? No. No. Oh, I'm so pissed. No way. This can't be fucking happening right now. <sighs>
It took so long to get here. All right, well, I guess I have to restart. I got no other choice. All right, let's see what happens if uh, you don't disconnect before you go into this circle. Oh, enter. What is, what is this? this? Has your tiny mortal mind snapped? This looks sweet. Do you really think you can defeat me? Oh, yeah, I think I can beat you. If I cannot control your world, I will destroy it. Destroy this. Pulls out nuts through zipper. Oh, he's got a health bar and it's three tiered. So what do I hit? Can't hit that. Doesn't look like. Yeah, it just says no. Does he not take damage from this? It's gonna really suck if he only takes... Oh, shit. This whole floor is electrocuting. I'll siege go. Oh, my God. Almost went down right there. Okay, here's some ammo. Let me pick it up with this to see if I can do damage to him over here. Oh, wait. A max ammo. I'll be taking that. Still says no. Oh, what's in here? Oh, there's skulls? Let's throw it at him. Fuck it. Okay, let's throw it on to Gersh real quick. Give me like two seconds to think. Let me grab the skull. What happens if I throw it up there? Nothing. What do I do with this? Um, big problem. Skulls outside of the map. Let's hope uh, I don't need all of them. Because I don't want to fucking restart this again. Give me this skull. Let me throw that right there. Eat it. We'll take this skull, throw it into this. So we just got to throw it into all the orbs. Easy enough. That's going to really suck if I can't break that last orb because this skull is out of the map. Oh, well, I guess most of the orbs are out of the map. Or at least this one is. Fuck it, dude. Can I go back there? Don't look like it. Maybe at least not yet. Can I do damage to him now? Still no. Well, I think we threw the game. Actually. Come here! Do they respawn? Oh, it does. Genius. Brilliant map design. It's idiot proof. Even for me. Where's this last orb I gotta throw this shit at, though? I do not see it. Oh, it was in here the whole time. Let's go. Now we can actually do some damage to him. So I'm gonna throw on a Gersh so the zombies leave me alone while I'm doing this. And fuck him up. Oh, he immediately took down his health. Okay. Is it the same thing for phase two? Are the orbs back? Oh, yeah. This door is not open anymore. So no more skulls. Oh, another door is opening. What we gotta do in here? Activate. I will call for someone more worthy of your strength. Okay, what does that mean? Oh, are we getting a, a high value enemy? High value target? Guess what? Immediately dead. That was worthy of my strength? Yeah, right. Oh, and we get his cannon arm? Play with my dick, dude. Putting that shit into there? That's so clean. Oh, he's fucking me up a little bit though. Low health is shit. Now I can damage him? Guess what? Phase two? See you later. On to the next. One more phase left. I'm assuming we gotta wait for another door to open. Because it was one door, two door. And there's gonna be a little device behind door number three we're gonna have to use. Oh, another door's opened. What we gotta do in here? Play with his urethra? Oh no, another high value target. Two of them actually. Oh, Tempest, easy. Done. Forget about it. Mangler, also done. Forget about it. I don't really get what I'm supposed to be doing in here, though. Oh, shit. Kind of just lasered into here. He fucked up his own rectum. Oh! And there goes his health! So he took himself out. Dumbass. I could never. No, you cannot do this. I cannot fail. Well, looks like he did. So, eat nuts. I'm not sure what we can do, children. The heart is destroyed. But he continues to persist. He is still gathering large amounts of energy for something. Where are you gathering all this energy for? What are you spawning in? A dimensional portal. He's leaving this plane of existence. Oh, he's trying to teleport away? Yes. He has absorbed enough power to pierce the dimensional veil itself. Should you wish it, the rift would bring you back home. Oh shit. Humans. He is heading not just for the place you came from, but the time as well. And annihilation is his only goal. What will we do here? With a large enough surge of energy, we could destroy that gateway entirely and send him to the depths along with it. Go big or go home, huh? <laughs> Can I have the go home option? True. I'll tell you something, Stu. Rust band thinks we are running out of room real fast. What do we Make do? Your choice, mortals. Go home, go home and begin, and begin anew, anew, or put an end to the cycle of suffering, suffering for good. 
We don't I'll put an end to this cycle. Oh, the guardian's what down. Is this, Do you think your toy can slay a god? Yes. <laughs> Definitely can. The choice is mine alone. Oh, we have to go over here if we want to do anything. Oh, wait, it's a pick one. Exposed portal? What does that mean, though? Can I not destroy it with this? All right, well, I guess this is the only thing we can do. Let's expose the portal. Rustman just realized that we don't really know squat about each other. Despite the fact that we've been fighting together for a long ass time. True. Let me ask you this, Rustman. Do you even have a family? Wife? Cute little kids. Bruce Band remembers some little ones. They had such big beaming smiles. They laughed all the time. <sighs> Love them until when they did. Damn. R.I.P. Russland's kids. Who'd you lose? <sighs> Same as yours, Russ. I had folks that I loved. Now I try not to think about them. Because it just uh reminds me of you know they're gone forever. R.I.P. Misty's I'm folks. Scared, Misty. I like understanding things, and these days I don't understand almost anything. Are we really going to be okay? We ain't gonna be okay, Marlton. Hey, hey. We're gonna be okay. Believe me. I'll look out for you, Marlton. You can trust me. I know what I'm doing. My dad was a Marine. Okay, I guess I'm feeling better about all of this. Sorta. All right, Stollinger. Make the call. Your objective found. Finish the fight. What, we just blow this up now? Oh, we're doing damage now. We're getting hit markers. Eat it. Let's fucking go. Take all the spears. It's a big glowing ball of yellow. And this shit's about to go. Screen's turning white. Sound is fading. Is that it? I'm gonna keep tossing them. I've lost all sight. But I can still feel the, the vibration of something being thrown. Oh, there we go. I think it exploded. I think we fucked it up. Oh shit, That's another so cutscene, cool. let's go. The champions of humanity gave up the very last thing they owned to save us all, their lives. As the depths of the dark ether swallowed them whole. So it looks like Victus took themselves them out them, to take this dude out. Not show regret Clean. Or Rather, they told of an unfettered determination, the likes of which is only seen in human. What a cool end for the Victus crew. To give up, roll over, and let evil win, no matter the odds they seem to face. Against all of our calculations, they managed to keep the false parasite King Agamemnon from regaining a foothold in this realm. Even after how power Bro got dusted. While the future of oh, the Ted's still there! Is uncertain, He's crawling the away! Learned for sure. In a world of demons and gods, the greatest unknown factor is humanity. <gasps> Zykov? For both good and evil. Crazy. But holy shit. If you got access to BO3 on PC, you know, get this workshop map and play it. It is literally the best thing I've ever played. Uh, from made from this community is absolutely phenomenal and i think i kind of like that i got disconnected on our first run because we were about to clear the whole thing but having to go back through and playing again uh gave me a, a greater uh what's the word admiration for the work put into this map it is beautiful it is perfect it is the best custom map ever made and this is what outbreak should have been but with that being said i'm gonna go ahead and end it here thank you guys for watching i truly appreciate all your love and support and i'll see you in the next one later